All right, guys. So another one we're going to use that like going to be more of an offense, kind of using the knee lever, is uh, using a position that we call the praying hands, right? Where my arm is already across my body, my partner is flattening me out. And I use the knee lever along with the praying hands to off balance my partner. Okay. This works very, very well. So now I'm staying low. So my partner comes and he looks to flatten me out. Look, my hands were, look where they're at. I have my hands right in this position right here. Okay. So now I'm going to get a lot of, a lot more momentum with these hands that I do just with my feet in the knee lever. I'm gonna do the same exact thing, but I don't need my I don't need my my knees to be as tight because my bottom leg is really gonna work sim simultaneously with my hands. Right. I like that, right? And more simultaneously, it's simultaneously. Got it. So from here, I'm gonna reverse this way. So I don't need to be as much in underneath my partner. Okay. And I see this a lot right here when somebody's really coming underneath the head. Right. And I see this here. All I'm going to do is I am going to come foot over foot. I'm keeping these hands poked out and I need to off balance. Right. Boom. Here. And I'm using this to push all the way through. Now, what do we want to do from here? Generally speaking, we you get right to the Ashi position, which you fit right into an offense. So I just created space. Now I want to take up the space. How do I take up the space? All I'm going to do is I'm going to reach over while I keep this hand out. So I'm keeping his upper body away from me. All right. So he can't sit back into me. This leg is going to come right to my partner's hip while my lower leg shimmies itself in. But I get right to this position here. So now I took back up the space. Okay. And now I have my heel hooks. I have my Achilles locks. I have my reversals. I have a lot of things. But I created space and then I took up the space. Okay. Let's see it again. And this works well because my hands are in that praying hand position when his arm is on the body. What I want you guys to think about, I don't want your arm to be all the way over here. Like I want this top hand elbow to be on your rib cage. Okay. Now I'm pressing my hands together. I don't have this arm out here. I bring his elbow in. Okay. From here, foot over foot. Pull your hips underneath. Use the praying hands. Everything works together. Look how my head. Look. Look what my head does. I'm pulling my hips underneath as I do so. Look, my hips come underneath and my head comes out here. Now I'm going to add the hand movement in there too, right? I'm here. Hands at the same time. Keep turning. All right. Foot comes in. Knee comes in. Get your partner right here. You have the Ashi position. You can start working. You could work reversals, especially if your partner stands up. You can go right to X guard. All right. So it'll be fairly easy for you guys to do so. Or, you know, it's going to really depend on what you want to do. But you do have an offense from there. All right. Give it a try.